Um, we want to buy a camera so we can, when we go around to events we can video people and also one that can take stills. Have you been to this library before? I have, yes. Um, to drop some posters off for the display. But I don't live near here so it's not my local library to actually use. So why have you come down to the Well, I work just around the corner and, um, and I want to know more about making films. So that's why I'm here. Do you have any questions for? Have you, have you got any questions about anything you've learned or answers even? Um, <laughs> um, yeah, I, I, later on maybe I would like a bit more information about smaller tripods because it, what would be really useful to me would be a tripod small enough to fit in my designer hands. Is, is this your local library? This is actually quite local to where I live, which is why I chose to come here today, because I live in Heslington, so it's only a five minute cycle ride. Okay, if we pull out and we get both of them, um, and we have you close together again, should we ask, can we ask you both, um, do you think this workshop is going well so far, and do you think it would be good to try and continue this kind of thing? I, I've enjoyed it, I've not yeah. been here very long, but I've enjoyed it so far, so it looks promising. Oh, I agree with Catherine. I think it looks very promising, yes. And do you think it would work well in partnership with other local organisations? Of, of which you two are representatives of? Um, I think that it would work particularly well. One idea that was in the back of my mind as the funding advisor at York CVS, I'm aware of a new project um, which is an online fundraising website called See the Difference. Um, and the point of that is that charities and small voluntary groups can upload videos of their own work mm. and people can then donate towards them. And I thought that if I had a video camera, I could offer to go and help local charities to do their little videos. Um, what would you say if um, we, we, we had a few closed sessions specifically set aside for organisations that I think we might still have unbooked? Well, I work for a very small charity. And, um, and we'd be interested in doing something like that. It would be you know, really useful for us. Okay. Should we swap over and then do you want to talk or are you happy just... Yeah, I'm happy to be the, the guy behind the camera. <laughs> okay. Do I have any idea what's going on? Um, we, we do have a plan, um, but we don't stick to the plan so much on every occasion because sometimes it means we overrun. So today we've been playing it very much by ear. Um, according to the brochure, which I believe is quite correct, um, it says we will learn how to operate a video camera and I think that's, that's people have had a go on the camera. Well I think anyone watching this piece of film will agree that we are really sticking rigidly to that part of the programme and we are learning how to use a video camera. Yes, um, and then it says the second half of the session which starts five minutes ago. Um... <laughs> I don't want to keep you, but please answer the question. <laughs> God, God might say hurry up. And um, <laughs> in my head he says, the second half of the session we'll look at the group's work um, and uploading it onto the internet after a short edit. That's fantastic. Thank you very much. It's been Thank great you. talking to you.